Y'all, we're sinking a lot faster than we were. I remember the water was just barely above the door. Today, we're gonna sink this ship, but the problem is I have to stay in it while it sinks. And make sure you stay till the end to see if I'm able to survive. Let's get this thing started. I already feel this thing listing to the left. It's probably because I'm on the left. I'm really heavy. Okay, so we're gonna get all these bastards. Everyone follow me. We gotta get this thing started. Actually, you know, you guys can sail. Hello, hello. Yes, I am your captain. Okay, um, I totally forgot how to start this. Oh my God. Do I really have to go in the engine room? That's all the way back there. Oh my gosh. Okay, how do I get in the engine room? guys we got to do that okay we're down here in the disgusting engine room it is so loud down here okay we're gonna do engine on and off coolant pumps this one on and off and there we go all right engine should be on but now i actually have to go back up here and activate full throttle here we go full throttle is currently on and are we driving um oh we are driving how convenient okay so now let's go out here this thing is full throttle okay we're going pretty fast right now is that debbie oh it's debbie and of course she's on the left side of the boat she's probably weighing it down to that side i knew it i knew something was going on okay so let's go to our map here let's see where we should sink this thing we're gonna go in a really far away area so that's really far 18 kilometers so i don't know if i have the time for that oh wow this thing's really just leaning right now i hope we don't capsize before we even get there oh game just like there for a second we are turning to the starboard as hard as we can we can even see the lean in the ship this is actually really cool oh my gosh i can feel it from here uh so i'm gonna try staying in the ship i might even take some passengers down with me but i will try saving some in some of these lifeboats i'll be nice and i know this thing does have some sinking modes on it i totally forgot what they were or how to even activate them i think there's like some secret button somewhere i really hope there is because i don't know how to sink this thing manually anyways we better tour this thing before we do end up sinking it so we kind of have an idea of what area we should be at in this thing so up here um it's probably about a oh okay well i found the button anyways um up here is a little area what's behind here nothing okay okay so we basically toured all the inside areas up here and then over here is just some deck and then we have a staircase that actually goes down i'm gonna take a guess here awesome looking pretty nice in here and these are some of the swingy doors they got going on here okay okay so i'm gonna go way below deck now is this an elevate no way they got an elevator oh, okay we're gonna go hold it down here i can stop it midway through the floors that's actually kind of concerning all right we're at this floor now um uh what floor is this i don't know it's really dark in here i don't exactly know what this is I'm, this is a passenger boat but i need some of these rooms to be actually able to be opened okay so here's a nice little crew stairwell um i can't open none of these doors probably for leg purposes anyways um this is the mail room right here that's actually really cool we got a mail room i don't know how we would exactly receive the mail that's probably the most interesting part but here's the cargo section oh wait this kind of looks familiar i feel like i might have done a event on this ship here and to participate in the events we should have gone and join the discord link is in the description real quick we do events uh every so often not we don't have like a consistent time but here's a nice little dining area all right looks nice i really wish i could turn on the lights i forgot how but here i am on the bottom of the ship in the engine room right here is a bulkhead door so this thing can close on a command if there's water um it should though it's not okay well that's just amazing um up, up here's this uh coal area if i had to take a lovely get um light boiler wait our boilers aren't on i don't know if they're supposed to be okay well we're gonna turn them on uh, and then there's a giant room down here which is a whole lot of nothing like literally nothing is in this room towards the front here we have another cargo section so that's basically the boat uh it is a pretty nice day out here i did check the weather the radar did say it was gonna get pretty rough so that might even contribute with the sinking we'll see but also with that being said i'm gonna go ahead and bring some of these people inside i am feeling a little bit of sprinkles on my face here yeah everyone follow me let's all get inside here it's really gonna get probably pretty rough out here especially in this sea on land it's a it's really nice but in the sea it's like a whole different story when the weather starts to get worse um we're not are we in the north sea oh we're in the south sea yeah we're fine uh the north sea is way worse if you guys know what i'm talking about it is terrible oh a whole bunch of people following me okay so we don't exactly have cabins but i will lead you guys in here probably to the bottom floor so that'll make it really fun to rescue you guys okay so everyone follow me down here you know you get you can stay in here that's the walmart version of debbie we'll maybe put someone in the elevator shaft all right there you go but i don't think there's like a single cabin that we can actually go in yeah this is all just like completely guarded off here is everyone following me still okay there are thank you okay maybe we'll set debbie in this hallway right here and then in the storage compartment or in the mail room here let's see we got some mail room employees so we'll put like three people in here three people operating the mail someone can sleep right there awesome hope you're enjoying that all right so let's see uh one person's following us his name's mark okay he can stay there all right and then this lady right here will be our actual captain as of now so you better keep us out of these storms actually hold on i'm gonna turn to the starboard here we gotta get to this waypoint 18 kilometers away all right we're going full starboard full starboard prepare the crew uh, activate the general alarm if necessary of course but i got this thing cranked you will feel 
feel a bit of a lean look these propellers just actually propelling us you know doing their job and all all right real quick how many lifeboats do we have so we have one two three four is there any like floaty devices or anything i'm not actually seeing any up here on the deck i'm gonna set the captain up here hopefully they know what they're doing i'm gonna go back here and just sit on this lovely couch right here oh my gosh what is the captain driving us into um what in the world is that what are you driving us in captain oh my gosh i'm taking the helm oh these people really don't know how to drive a ship for once well here we are about to hit a super small tsunami actually this is i would say this is a wave yeah that's not even a tsunami right yeah please agree with me so we're just gonna label this as a small wave i need to go on the radio right now oh wait this is like a 1700 ship um anyways we'll uh, morse code maybe probably not please activate the general alarm for the downstairs compartments okay so here we go we're gonna activate the general alarm there we go engine room should be preparing right now we are going to rise this thing and hopefully end up surviving that is of course the goal we're gonna hit this thing head on because that's normally what you're supposed to do even though i hit them sideways sometimes just for fun but we should start rising it here momentarily we got this thing on full throttle so we can desperately try climbing it and here we go it's actually not doing too bad uh the, the deck isn't going underwater yet okay third person view here oh wow oh gosh okay the back has just gone completely swept oh we're getting a lot of air time that is not good we're gonna be piercing is that a path oh my gosh oh my i think we've just seen a ma'am are you okay lord have mercy i think we need some medical staff yeah you should not be doing a movement like you know what um we're just gonna can we can please get off the boat we don't have any medical we're low on staff ma'am please get off the boat we'll see you later all right we'll probably see her on the news that she went missing on a ship and never came back and there'll be a whole like movie article on her anyways um the structural integrity of the ship is slowly declining i sound like a nerd but really i think we definitely broke something i better go ahead and turn off this alarm they're probably mad at me i mean really not oh we didn't even close the watertight doors well there's no water i mean i don't see any water warnings back here so this thing i think did survive i am noticing the weather actually slowly starting to increasingly get worse as you can see um let's see please make sure nobody else gets out here on the deck because you know the, we cannot have any actual passengers out here you remember what just happened to that girl that literally landed probably on top of you i don't know that would have actually been funny if she would have taken damage also but really no one should be out here also i really don't want to use these lifeboats anymore because i feel like they're actually damaged from what happened why is there so many people out here i thought i put y'all inside you know what you're not following the rules you you can follow these rules you can follow the ocean life rules have fun oh these passengers just make me angry all right we're gonna go back up here it should just be all smooth sailing from here right oh wow the weather's just getting beautiful out here what is going on what do you drive us into well the weather did say it was gonna get bad or the weather radio or whatever i listened to in the beginning okay so the waves are hitting us from the port side slightly you're normally supposed to hit them head on but i think we're fine we're in a large enough ship where it shouldn't matter too much hey you stay up here i think i am hearing some slushing noises going on actually below the deck here so i need to go down there and check it out i am hearing water i think from the ventilation and maybe some of the engineers screaming down there but that's besides the point well, let's go ahead and see what's going on down here oh my gosh what could it possibly be that they're yelling at me for okay hello how's it going and i use the elevator to get down maybe down it's not letting me get to i can go up but not down okay you know what i don't know what to do okay so i'm down here right now i don't know where the engineers or uh, the people were at i don't know what they're screaming about either i'm not seeing it oh wow oh what is that is that from the tsunami oh my gosh y'all okay close the doors close the door uh the bulkheads aren't working or the watertight doors that are supposed to close when i close them aren't working y'all i don't know what's going on in this room but i am not gonna stick around to find out there's water actually filling up the bottom compartments of our ship oh my gosh it's going so fast too okay so i'm gonna go back upstairs maybe start loading life bolts i'll consider it you know i don't really think it might be necessary yet i wonder if there's like some type of microphone i can go on to like announce the ship that we may or may not be sinking right now i mean you know i think they'll be fine downstairs here you know i'll put the captain on a light boat we'll deploy this light boat um oh don't rip oh my god oh my gosh we've just lost a lifeboat i thought the light boat was like connected to the ground so i clicked release light boat okay well we got it we got three more that's fine so we're gonna go ahead and click the divot thing get to the other side there we go awesome oh wow i would not want to be in that thing oh my gosh okay i'm gonna set you on and have fun oh great man overboard man overboard um where did the captain go oh so you're just gonna sit up here and watch me fly overboard and not even stop the ship okay i'll remember that here um oh i'm trying to put you in a seat i'm not trying to throw you oh my gosh uh yeah these doors are actually getting really close to going under on some of these waves here which is a little bit concerning but i mean we're fine in here right i'm not dying you know where, where are all the passengers at i think i see debbie right there how's it going in here y'all let's see what's going on in the mailroom you guys pass
pack my mail and my Amazon packages? You better be. I got a whole bunch of stuff that's supposed to be coming in, and I don't see anything in these shelves. I'm actually a little bit mad at you right now. Hold on, hold on a second. Does one propeller look like it's going faster than the other one? Tell me which one right now down in the comments, left or right. I, I really feel like the left one, or there's something wrong with the right one. Um, what was that? My ears actually just popped. Um, what's going on out here? I just heard like a big amount of pressure just go through the hallway. Honestly, I really don't know what it is, but these stabilizers really suck. Like, look at this thing. Oh my gosh, this is actually like really scary. Uh, I need to go out here on the deck. I might need to throw up. Um, how do I get out? Oh my gosh, let me out of this thing. What in the world? Hey, you gotta close that door. Oh, that's why my ears popped. Okay, well, you guys cannot have these doors open. I don't care if you're sightseeing or doing whatever you're doing. That is slightly dangerous. Oh my gosh, we're going straight towards the volcano. That's exactly what we need right now. This is really just going to crap real fast. Our propellers are sticking out of the water on the back, which is normally not something you'd like to see at all. But I mean, I guess my videos is totally fine. Uh, I really think we're going down from the front, though. Do you guys think so also? Oh, wow, that's bad. Well, that's just amazing. So the right propeller has just completely given up on life. That's exactly what's going on right now. The left one's doing good. Right one's just off. And you know what that's doing? That's actually propelling us towards the island. That's amazing. How's it going back here on the lifeboat? Going good? Well, I think we're sinking, so you better stay on there. Okay, the waves have settled down a little bit. Um, Ma'am, you cannot be... Is that water? No, you are not getting water on my crap green carpets. You guys are just so rude to me. I just bought this too. Well, from the looks of it, it does look like we're kind of going down from the bow here. I better get started and get in a position that I may survive in. Okay, so this is the bottom of the ship. This is the engine room back here. This is the coal room. It's actually not even at this point yet. Maybe we could open this door and get some fresh air in here. Oh yeah, perfect. But yeah, as you can see, it's definitely just having issues down behind the coal room. Oh my gosh, it's like filled to the brim already almost. Oh my gosh, what was that? Did Debbie like fall down the stairs or something? Oh my gosh, I need to check on the mail room. Um, what's happening down here, Mar? Did the toilet get clogged? Like, what's going on? Okay, we're gonna go in the mail room here. You guys fine? Oh, the mail room didn't explode. Okay, that's a good sign. What happened? I, I'm so confused. Well, I have a slight feeling we're sinking. I'm gonna try saving just a couple people on these light bulbs before we do sink. So I'll save this lady right here. Okay, that's good enough. Okay, bye. Um, how do I launch you off here? All right, have fun on your life boat, ma'am. And release. Uh, just release it. We don't need to lower her. Awesome. Oh, you need help? Well, that's too bad because you guys open these doors, not me, idiots. Oh my gosh. Oh, there goes the power. Okay, well, I don't know what happened. I think one of the breakers might have just exploded down there. Um, well, that lady was launched out of the boat. Oh my gosh, this thing's going down, y'all, and I have to stay on it. Oh no, I'm actually so scared right now. Okay, so I better get inside before water starts filling it in. Okay, so we're gonna go in here. We'll just leave the door open behind us. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, I'm gonna take a passenger with me. All right, you, you're gonna be following me and you're gonna live with me. All right, what's going on down here in the mail room? Is there any water? I'm not seeing any water yet. Oh, it's building up slowly. No, are you just watching it? Yeah, he's probably mildly concerned. Okay, the mailroom doesn't seem like a bad option here. Oh, wait. Oh, wow. Yeah, it's probably a, one of the worst options. So we do have actual water starting to flood in the mailroom. Uh, yeah, definitely not this one. Have fun in here, guys. I'm going to be locking that room down. All right. What's going on in the stairwell here? Is there any water in the stairwell? Um, It's definitely filling it up. Okay, so stairwell is a dunzo. Not going in there. I can just feel the lean of the bow currently sinking right now. That's just an amazing feeling. Okay, we're going to close some of the doors behind us. Oh, it's getting bad, y'all. There's water really flooding in here. Um, please call Coast Guard. Oh my gosh, we have to stay in this crap. No way, I'm gonna survive. Oh, the stay in the ship challenges are so fun, though. Okay, so, uh, hopefully this spitty door is waterproof and it will block the water from going in here. We'll have our last dinner. What's going on out here? Um, oh wait, th there's a kitchen in here. This actually isn't a bad spot. Okay, I'm gonna station in this room. This is gonna be the room that will survive. Hopefully. Uh, yeah, maybe not. We'll see. And here's an outside POV currently. It is not looking too good for the ship. Uh, we will be sinking today. I would have to take a guess on that. And look, we actually do have one per- Oh, wow. Oh, God. Okay, so we do have an oil spill, but we do have one person in a light boat, which is good. You know, we got some survivors here and there. Where did the captain go? I don't know where they're at. Okay, y'all, we're sinking a lot faster than we were. I remember the water was just barely above the door, and now it's um, definitely above. Okay, so where was the kitchen at? Um, I forgot. Where was that? We got to go there fast because we're definitely going down. Okay, so we're going to hide in here. Uh, start making lunch. This might be our final meal. Oh, oh, crap. Oh, oh, what does that lead to? Oh, no. Y'all, that leads straight to the engine room, which is on the bottom of the ship and probably about to be filled with water. Oh, gosh. We're going straight vertical. I feel it. It's going really fast, too. I'm just lining it up. Okay, we got, we got to go in photo mode. We got to see this. What's going on out here? Oh, wow. We're about to sink, dude. This is it. Yeah, we're going down. Oh, that's really bad. Y'all, I would stay clear from the ship when we're sinking like this. It does not play around when it does a ton of water it'll try actually sucking you down i think from what 
what I know. But yeah, as of now, half, basically the entire ship is underwater besides this back section, which is about home to nothing. Yeah, there's nothing back there. Oh, look, the oil cleared up. That's lovely. Okay, so we're in this room right now. It isn't too bad. I'm still concerned that we're going to start seeing some water flood through that uh, ladder, which is a very big possibility because once again, that is the bottom of the ship. Okay, I'm going to open the door here. Do not walk over here. Oh, wait, the top door is open. That's kind of concerning, but let's open this bottom door. Let's see if there's any water. Oh, no. Yo, it's climbing. It's climbing really fast, y'all. Um, We need to find a way to close that top one or else we will drown in this thing. It's going to be a basically indoor swimming pool. I mean, it technically already is, which is pretty cool, but look, it, yeah, it's definitely rising. Okay, I'm going to lock that down. All right, let's hope there's enough oxygen in this room to survive. Can I jump and close it? Oh, I, I really can't. Oh, no. Okay, well, let's just really hope it doesn't go over that door anytime soon. Or right, how's it going over here? You better be done with the dinner. Let's get a third person view real quick. Unpause the game. There we go. Okay, it's, oh, wow, what's going on? Normally, when that water particle happens, that means a lot of water is actually filling up a certain area at once. Um, okay, let's go in here. Oh, oh, wow, it's filling up, definitely. Um, where's our door at? I don't know, somewhere over here, but yeah, we're completely under, really far down. I think, yep, we've actually hit the bottom. Yeah, the entire bow section is just destroyed from us hitting the bottom. Is it up to the, oh, it's up to the door. Oh my gosh, once it goes over that door, we're screwed. Okay, we gotta close it. Go, 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 go. Y'all, I cannot get up there. Sir, can you please try reaching? Oh no, oh, that's bad. Oh no, is it gonna fill it? It's not gonna fill it up, is it? Oh wait, it might save us here because it's going down to that section of the boat instead of this one. Oh yeah, we're fine. We're doing good. This isn't gonna be a problem. I still really am scared about that door being open though. Can I like jump on this? Will it break it open? <laughs> Hopefully I'm not too bad. Okay, please close that. Um, what's that noise? I hear a bell ringing out there. Oh wait, are we leveling out? What's going on? We're really rotating right now in a weird position. We're like totally sideways now. I do hear a bell ringing though. I think the button that sounds the alarm up there in the cabin or the bridge actually just went off. So something must have just touched that. That's actually really creepy just to think about, but I think we might level out here. Um, I can see down here. So this is the engine room. I'm not seeing any water, which is good. Uh, the power's just completely cut out in the ship. It's good that I have a flashlight, but this is really creepy. Let's get a third person view once again, real quick. It's completely blacked out. We're at the bottom of the ocean floor here. We're super deep. Well, the power's back on again. Um, that's amazing. <laughs> it's flickering on and off. I, that's actually so creepy. I'm scared down here. Well, I mean, I'm not dying in this room and I'm sure there's more rooms like this with actual oxygen in it. So should I try swimming? Oh, maybe to the mail room. Do you guys think the mail room's still available? Uh, okay, I'm gonna try going there real quick. Uh, let's go through here. Can I squeeze through, please? All right, here you go. You ready? Here we go. Okay, I'm gonna try swimming through here. I'm already getting crushed by a ton of stuff here. Y'all, the mail room is not... Oh my gosh, let me get back. I need air. Is there air pocket in here? Please, let me get air. No, no. Oh my gosh, we died. I should have just stayed in that stupid room. Hold on, I need to go back. And there it is at the total bottom of the ocean. Dude, look at the view. This is crazy. So I tried swimming into the mail room right here and I saw a ton of bodies, which really was welcoming. They're not here anymore. They probably just integrated. Oh, someone's still sleeping here. But let me know if we should do this challenge again down in the comments. And if you haven't already, be sure to go to drop a like and subscribe on the video. Drop a comment on what we should do next. And lastly, join the Discord. Link is in the description. But thank you guys all for watching until the end. And goodbye.